good afternoon from old Dhaka here in Bangladesh. Guys, I'm joined with a couple of friends behind me and uh, we're going to be exploring old Dhaka again. There's a few places that I missed when I was here with them here. Uh, we need to check out the, uh, the museum, Lalabag Fort I think is the name. And it's basically this really beautiful pink museum. So we're going to check that out and we're also just going to roam around for the day. Try some street food, try some different drinks. Uh, we'll see, maybe. My stomach <laughs> still hasn't 100% uh, been settled since I got food poisoning when I was here a little while ago. But we're just chilling on the cruise boat here. This is like similar to the one that me and Nadir actually uh, were on a, a couple weeks ago. So this is actually the best one. We were just like checking out the area and they have some really nice rooms that are around like 10,000 uh, tucker a night. So around $100 a night to go to the next city. Uh, but <laughs> look at this guy, he's yelling off at the other people, but yeah, let's go and explore Old Dhaka for the second time. I'm sure we'll come across some interesting things. Jalan. We called him Lodge. What do you call them? Lodge. Lodge, that is the name of the ship. That is the name of the ship. So where did you say this one was going to? Uh, what city? Barisha. Barisha. And that's like... Uh, uh, most of the logs going to Dhaka from Barisha. Ah. You see it there. Barishal, Dhaka, Barishal. Oh, Barishal. And that's like what, in terms of geography, it's like how, what part of Bangladesh it's? South. South? Yeah. yeah. Why does everyone go to Barishal? <laughs> because... <laughs> it is one of the loveliest city. Loveliest city. And yeah. people are very good. Yeah. Uh, like Kulnas. Yeah. Anyways guys, let me introduce you to a few people. So this is Michael. So, We've known each other for a couple years. Yeah. We met in, well we met for the very first time actually in Bangkok and coincidentally we're here together at the same time in Dhaka which is really cool. Um, you've been here what, three times? This yeah, is your three, three times. times. Yeah. And like I guess everyone here you know through your agency. Yeah, I met with that a few years ago, I met Vinayak two years ago. <laughs> Vinayak Sachi, you're from what state in India? Karnataka. Karnataka. So he flew all the way over here to Dhaka for a couple days just because Michael's in town. So, yeah. Everyone here is uh, an entrepreneur, I guess. <laughs> Businessman. Yeah. But that's the crew we got for the next couple hours as we explore Old Dhaka. And Old Dhaka, you know, it has that, that scent. My nose is actually still a little bit blocked from the uh, the cold that I have, but uh, you can you can definitely smell. Oh, what's going on down here? Dog fight, hey? Dog fight on the on the water. Where are they? I'm not sure. But at that moment, we're trying to find somebody on this cruise ship that can actually like show us around and show us like the engine room and show us all the really nice uh, rooms that they have available. As I said, ten thousand to fifteen thousand. A night it is for like the VIP room, which is like like full luxury. So hopefully we'll be able to get inside and uh, and check it out. But for now, we just get to enjoy this view. Over there is where me and Adir caught the little boat over to the other side of Old Dhaka. Um, but it's cool just like being able to chill on these mega yachts, just absolutely massive cruise liners, and they just go all the way down. It's crazy. It's all of them going to their different ports in uh, in Bangladesh. I think they're trying to organize something now. Oh yeah. So here are all the rooms, guys. These like the little cabins that you can uh, book out. Kind of like a private room, but there's also like on the lower floor there is like a place where kind of like the like it's kind of like economy but I do need to use the bathroom. So I'm gonna be, oh, it's so dark in here. Oh, is there a light? Is there a light anywhere? Oh, up here. Maybe the ship needs to be on. All right, I guess we'll have to pee elsewhere. So how much, how much would it cost to Catch. $34. Sorry? $4. In this, in this, this, is this area, maybe $34 to Barisham, right? Uh, $34 in 
Yeah. Wow. Uh, two, two dollars. Two dollars. Two dollars. Two point five. Two to two point five dollar. If you are in this deck, if you yeah. go up, it is it will go higher. Wow. When you book any cabin, you have to pay uh, minimum uh, ten to fifteen dollars. Ten to fifteen dollars for the cabin. Uh, yeah. Wow. That's except a, except VIP cabin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the engine room. Wow, look at this boat, it's like, it's literally sinking. Look at that, it's, it's got a lean to the right, <laughs> the water's like overflowing. Now these are big ships, like just coming through the canals, all these little boats have to be careful when they make the journey across. Or maybe it's designed like that, I'm not sure. So are the other people that are sleeping here, are they waiting for the, like when it departs tonight? Yeah. 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 So this is called date and uh, uh, this uh, $2 wow. per night. And when you book any cabin, uh, it will cost uh, 10 to $15. Yeah, thousand. Dollar. Yeah. Not thousand, $15. Oh, dollar. Do oh. I mean 1000 taka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes it raises uh, $20 also. Yeah. When the, any occasion comes, like uh, Idul Fit or Idul Ajaha, I mean Eid. Yeah. Eid or it's really busy during Eid time? Huge. Huge. Yeah. And then it will uh, rise uh, almost uh, uh, $30. Wow. Per cabin. What do you think of old Dhaka Michael? Sights, smells, exciting. <laughs> Overwhelmed. Yeah. Today than normal though. Yeah, it's remarkably not that busy. But this guy's selling uh, samosas of some sort. I don't think they're actually samosas, they weren't triangle. Before we started filming, Michael was like, how much would you, you have to be paid to have like a, a drink of this, like a cup of water? And I said a million. A million dollars I would do this. I'd drink that. He would do it for a hundred thousand. But I also was like, I wonder if you actually survive. Like what kind of bacteria is in here to make it go this color? How much would you guys uh, need to drink a cup of this water? Let me know. <laughs> all right, look at all the food options that we have over here. Lots of seafood as well. But being a Friday, it's a little bit quieter than uh, other days of the week. It was actually remarkable at how quick we got down into Old Dhaka. Barely any traffic and we were in an actual car so we weren't able to maneuver but oh, look, we've got roller skates. We didn't even have to uh, sit in traffic at all but right now we're heading to uh, the museum that I believe is called Lalbag Fort and it's like a really beautiful pink area. I saw it the very first time I was in uh, in Old Dhaka, but we didn't actually go inside. We just saw it from the distance in the in the boat that me and Adil were on. So, wow. Ah, oh, look at these guys. The watermelon shop. How much does one kilogram of watermelon cost? Uh, like. Hundred taka. Uh huh. Fifty to hundred taka. Wow. <laughs> Look how many there are. Look at all the watermelons. They're just stacked up. Got uh, potatoes, I think. Over on that. No. I don't know what those are. And there's just so many watermelons. Oh, wow. Alright, here it is. Oh, so it's, it's not Lalbag Fort, it's Asan Manzil Museum. Look how beautiful it is. Look at <laughs> I think it opens at around 3 p.m. So the current time is 3:11. So we are allowed in. We've got some sugarcane juice over there, but I think all these people are waiting for the tickets. So you got to buy tickets here. The line goes all the way up there. How much is it? Visitor of other foreign countries, 500 taka. So five dollars or 40 taka, around 40 cents for a local. So here's the line. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I see you 
the video, Lo. Like, ah. So many times. Very good. You, you Welcome like to our country. Thank you very much. Are you going inside the fort? Yeah, yeah we are. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, it's it's good inside. Have you been before? Uh, no, 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 no. Been there I, I have been. It's, it's nice. It's yeah. nice. Yeah, it looks it looks beautiful. Yeah. How long have you been waiting for? Um, we're waiting for 15 minutes. Oh wow. Yeah. So yeah. it's a Friday, so that's why it's busy. Wow. Oh yeah, Friday. And they only open at three, so you know people have been waiting. Yeah. All right. Thank you for watching. Have fun, man. Have fun. Have a great day. Enjoy your stay. People are so friendly here. Hello. <laughs> Look at these balloons. Wow. We got Hello Kitty. We got sharks. We got unicorns. Salam alaikum. All right. Well, let's get in line and we will hop inside. India neck. Ah, do you want it? Yeah. Take it for them. Come, come. Come, come. Come, come. Okay, you can stay there and our ticket is coming. Oh, okay, okay. okay. How and much is the... You can go to the, like, that shed. How much is the price? 500 for you, yeah. 500 for you, <laughs> 300 for you. Oh, and that's for right. us, like 40. Okay. 300 is pretty expensive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I can actually really blend in him, like, as a Bangladeshi, but I don't want to because I'm honest. Yeah, person, yeah, so. that's good, that's good. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> Bengali Tindan and I. Asha, 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 yeah. They're nodding a lot. You're from Bangalore, right? Yeah, Bangalore. In Bangalore, they have the head head movement as well, yeah. the bubble. Like this and like this. Yeah, like, uh, it means yes or no. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> it's interesting. Uh, Going to like the different countries. But we're in everybody. So here it is. It's just like a really nice area where people are just like chilling out, exploring the area. Look at all these beautiful flowers, all kinds of colors. So you got purple. Violet, pink, red, more pink, yellow. Wow. But yeah, all these people are just chilling around. She's oh, she's dressed for the occasion. Look at that. All pink, getting the photo shoot right up against the pink building. All right, guys, we're going upstairs. Here we go. We've got about 30 odd stairs to get up until we enter inside. Look how beautiful it is. It's gorgeous. Wow. I love how people have the balloons for the little kids. That guy's he's smart, smart businessman selling the, uh, the balloons out there. But look how beautiful it is. It's just gorgeous. All right, let's go in. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, the other way. <laughs> oh, what? Ah, the inch. Oh, the entry's over there. All right, we're just stocking up some water because it's super hot out here. But I noticed. Look at this. The breastfeeding place. I was honestly surprised. You know, being like Bangladesh, it's pretty conservative, so I'm obviously not going to go in there and uh, film <laughs> lactating mothers. But maybe it's like an enclosed area, and you have like your own private room. But it is interesting that they specifically are like advertising that. Is uh, it going over that way? Salamu alaikum. Come on, Asha. Good. Ah, thank you very much. You going to go breastfeeding? <laughs> Is this the entrance? To the breastfeeding room. <laughs> I don't want to film over there. I can't. I'll face my camera this way. If you give me so much food, you'll be going to the breastfeeding room. You have to be Mike. Thank you. 
Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Selamat malam ki. Selamat malam ki. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Okay, thank you. Bye, Jay. Very nice to meet you. Can. Have a good day. <laughs> Jalon. <laughs> yeah, lots of people are just like they just come in here and chill. It's a cool area. Just to chillax on. We got a couple of dogs. There's another dog. There's another dog. Three dogs. Just in here. Hello. Assalamualaikum. Oh, oh. Not inside. Not allowed. Not allowed. Ah, oh, okay. All right. Well. Apparently everyone is allowed to film in here. So I guess the rules don't really apply. It says camera is strictly prohibited, but everyone's taking photos. So I'm gonna join. So look at this, we got a cake maker. Kettle. Kerosene lamp. All kinds of things. Is he is he the founding father? Yeah. yeah. Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. Poet of politics. You'll see his face everywhere in Bangladesh. The founding father of Bangladesh. Uh, he's very you know famous. Uh, obviously, like founded the country, or I'm not actually entirely sure of the politics for this. But look, armor of soldier, 153 centimeters. The period. 19th century. Wow, imagine those guys coming at you with their spears and about to get stabbed. But everyone seems to have their camera out and taking photos, so I'm sure it's not going to be that big of an issue. Wow, look how beautiful this is. Beautiful artwork. Oil painting. The pillar. What is this? Like a bomb? Boundary pillar. Well, it's literally just like a blockade. Wow. Oh, it's good they have the English uh, translation here. Let me just read through this quickly. It's an important palace of some chapters in the history of Bangladesh. At least five renowned leaders lived in this palace. And then they list them. Wow. All right, we're going into the palace dining room now. This is your wow. dining room. Oh my God. It's got like 50 seats in there. That's crazy. Look how many there are. What is that? Two, four, six, eight. Oh, oh, hello. <laughs> There's like 20 seats on each side and they got all the plates and all the jugs of water, all the serving platters. Wow. That's really cool. I think that's the best part so far, seeing this. And it's all like in, like set for how it actually would have looked like when people were living here and having all their big dinners with the powerful people. Oh my goodness. Look at this over here. Elephant skull. Hmm? Wow. Mummy height. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Look at the tusks on the thing. It's huge. Oh, and up there there's a... Its name is Peter Jong. That is the name of the elephant? Yeah. Peter Jong. Why? Oh, yeah. Peter Jong. Oh, he's very faithful and a favorite to Nawab Abdul Ghani. Look at these guys. Who are they? The founder leaders of the All Indian Muslim League. A group photograph of all Indian Muslim leaders who came to attend the 20th anniversary in 1906. Has 75 leaders. So these are all Indian guys. Indian Muslims. It's really beautiful, like oil painting. There's all those these like random objects, like this. What is this? Uh, pandan, kaftan. Got all the little cutlery. Yeah, is this out of like the the tusks? I think that would be expensive. Yeah, ivory. 
Oh, yeah, the comb would be crazy to make. Yeah, oh. Yeah, this is all made from elephant toss, like ivory. So it's very like difficult to get that kind of stuff nowadays, and rightfully so. But uh, where's the dice? Mm -hmm. It says there's a dice here. Four. Oh, is that a dice? Yeah. Four dice. It is number four. One, number two, four. Dice. Oh, it's not like a yeah, like a rolling dice. Yeah. <laughs> so we've got another room here, and I think that might be the end of it. That is. So this is the area that we entered in accidentally at the very beginning. But here we go. It's getting a lot more busy. A lot more people on the steps. A lot more people out there on a Friday, which is what today is. It's only open from three to seven, so after the prayer, it opens up, and then it's open for four hours uh, in the evening time. So it's a day off for everybody, start of the weekend. Uh, so a lot of people out and about doing family things, enjoying their time, just like we are. But uh, I think we're gonna head out, and we'll go and explore more of old Dhaka. Let's do it. <laughs> Look at the height difference here. Michael's like, take a yeah, yeah, let's do yeah? it. Let's do it, mate. <laughs> How's your Pakistan experience? Oh, amazing. Yeah, I know your paratha and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah give me paratha. Can I find cheese paratha here? Or? Uh, no, they don't do it. But they do cheese naan, I think. Oh, cheese naan. Try the cheese naan. So it's good? Yeah, it's good. Not bad. Yeah, nice. It's quite similar, but yeah. a little bit taste-wise is different. Yeah. That's all it is. Yeah, amazing. Yeah, amazing. I like your Where are you from, yeah. Dhaka? Um, you have a bit of a British accent. Yeah, yeah. I live in England. Ah, nice. Yeah, I'm nice. a British citizen. But I went there for um, study and all. Uh -huh. um, and uh, married, get married, and then stayed there. Now I came to see my old friend. Uh -huh. Where is he? He's yeah. gone. <laughs> yeah, the chubby one. And, <laughs> I'm joking. And we love food. We're trying food like you yeah, as well. Yeah, but yeah. we don't do vlogs. Yeah. yeah. No, enjoy it. Yeah. What's your favorite food so far? Uh, Birani all the time. Yeah. You know that. Yeah. yeah. It's not cheese, not cheese paratha. No. <laughs> from you, I'm getting some experience from it. Yeah. I want to. I want to. <laughs> oh, who's that? <laughs> Are you your friend? Yeah, yeah. He's my friend. <laughs> Very strong man. You should lift him up a couple of times. <laughs> Alright guys, we're just chatting with that friendly chap, he's uh, from England, but uh, <laughs> what I was saying was Michael is so tall, he's like, he's from Florida, uh, lives in Thailand, but uh, he travels a lot, he's travelled to a lot of places and that's how we first connected. Uh, he is very tall, he towers, like he's far taller than me, I'm like six foot, six foot one, but he is towering over me and of course the population here is a lot shorter, so he towers over everybody else as well. But uh, a lot more people are here now. A couple of foreigners, actually. I think I saw like a few, a few like guides um, in there, giving uh, giving their tours. Maybe like a big group. But we're heading back out. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Come on, come on, Tom and Omki? Yeah. <laughs> Very good. Alright, I'm going. Nice to meet you. Oh, the double handshake. <laughs> Am I in with Michael? Yeah. Uh, well, this, this guy's got the hardest job. The two uh the two big foreigners. Alright. So he's telling him to follow. Perfect, we got six people, so two on each. The whole army. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> got his big strong legs going. <laughs> bumper cars. <laughs> yeah, bumper cars. Yeah. 
Oh, biryani. We've, oh, all right, we got them up there. Where are the others? Are they behind us? Maybe. They got, they got us caught behind. <laughs> Oh, look at the power lines here. It's, it's like a, a big bag of spaghetti. <laughs> look at that. Wow. Oh. Oh my goodness. Alright, we're going out onto the main road here. We're trying to catch up to everybody, so we got... There's waters. Oh, there's a, Oh, no. Buses just rule the world here, so you gotta be careful of them. Alright. Rafat wasn't up there though. No, he's behind us. Oh, yeah, they're, they're far up ahead. I think our weight is uh is slowing us down a bit. He's getting his uh, workout done. Salam alaikum. <laughs> Shake. <laughs> I got to, I got I got denied. I got denied. Somebody shake my hand. Come on. It was, I I just got stood up. <laughs> Interesting going through. They can do five pound? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Alright. So how much does it say? How much is one? Uh, 40. 40? 40 taka. And what is pan? I've never actually had it before. That's it. That's, so is it like betel nut? Huh? Is it like, does it get you high or? No, 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 no. no. So you... It's, it's look very... But it actually help you like... Uh, um, uh, um, it's, uh, digestion. 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 Yeah. Ah, okay. It's really good. Well, it's good. Alright. And they add all these like different things onto yeah. it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, so he's making one now. Yeah. Salam alaikum. Alright. Do you guys want to, you want to try fire pond? I'm going to watch you first. Alright. Do you guys want some? Yeah. Yeah? You? No? Alright. We'll get Dean. Really Dean. No problem. Does it, does it taste good? Yeah. No problem is the thing I'm not sure about. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Slight problem. It's a healthy for a good digestion. Brother, we have three fire pond. Thank you. Alright, so here it is. So he's getting the three leaves here. Oh, they have been in the water. That's a bit concerning. But he cuts it like that. Oh, yeah. Dips it in the water. There's one, two, three. So, what's he adding? Are these like little jellies? Oh, bit here, bit there. Wow. He adds what looks to be like coconut shreds. Oh, and what is all the stuff that he's adding, Rafa? Like, it, so what is this stuff? Jelly? Jelly? This jelly? Yeah. Hey, konda konda kisi chhodo aur bola dao. Konda konda ki naam ki. 
I'm what's this stuff? I'm gonna go. 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 I'm gonna and oh wow, look how bright yellow that is. Is that good, right? Coconut. 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 Yeah. That's why I'm taking a bundle. Oh, is this what makes it fire? I don't know. Is that like alcohol? What is that? Is that good, right? Like rubbing alcohol? Uh, that's the flavor of the fire. Uh, fire. Fire. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So just to be clear, you you chew it and then you spit it out, right? Or you swallow it? All right, let's go. I'm a bit scared. So he lights it. Look at this, everybody. Fire pond here in Dhaka. Ready? Whoa. Oh. Go. Now it's everything is too. Right? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Oh my god. Oh wow. Oh. Yeah. Come on. Okay. One at me. At me. <laughs> it tastes like bubble gum. Like. Oh, I, I think I might, I might bomb it. <laughs> so do you, do you swallow? Really? No, oh, okay. No, not now, but you need to do more, and then it's like a bubble gum leaf. Wow. I'm getting all the flavor. You don't, you, you don't swallow it. You just throw it, it will go natural. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. For 20 minutes, it hurts. What thing, really? Hmm? What? <laughs> I can't I can't think. <laughs> right, I, go, I, go, I gotta go. Oh. <laughs> no, not <good. laughs> no good. Okay. Now that I have my mouth uh, filled. No, it's okay, I'll, I'll pay, I'll pay. It's all good. No, no, no. Oh. Very good. Thank you very much. Alright, now that I have my mouth free to speak, it didn't actually taste that awful. It just tasted like kind of like a mixture of like bubblegum sweets, and then you got like every time you hit the new flavor, you kind of tasted like obviously something different. There was the syrup in there, there was the, the jelly, there was the coconut shreds. But Ah uh, yeah, my I can see my tongue is like really orange. But wow, that was a good experience. Guys, right next to me, we've seen fire fuchka. Wait, fire fuchka, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, I'll try one. So they actually light it on fire. Yeah. So what are all these? There's broken heart. There's angry, angry love, trust, and, and light. Which one's the best one? It's good. Crush. Crush. Crush is good. Spicy. Oh, it's like the. Wow. So it's like. means spicy. Very Oh, very spicy. Which one? Low, low spice. Low spice. No, uh, spice. Spice. Halcom. Halcom kunda. Nay spice. Toy fuska. No, like. This one spicy, like nay, nay spice, no no spicy, no spicy crust, ah, crust love, love, broken heart and light. Ah okay. So what is like, what is the watery not, stuff? Not sweet, sweet. sweet. This sweet. 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 Okay. This is also sweet. This is not sweet. This is like some um, like not sweet. Um, savory, savory. Yeah, savory. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I'll, I'll try the love one. And this is like the hot one? Yeah, hot. I, won't, I don't want so hot. hot. You see? Hot. Yeah. Could I just try one love? Like, I only want one just to try it. Right. Okay. Yeah. I'll pay, I'll pay the full price, but I only want one. India. Yeah, one piece, one piece, one piece. Fire fuska, fire fuska. Yeah, yeah, fire. Yeah, yeah, fire, fire. Of course, fire. All right. So look at this. It goes on like that. 
He adds this red stuff here. I don't know what it is. Maybe that's the stuff that's flammable. Oh, and what is that? Not more is. Uh, it's, it's free. It's fire, fire. Fire. So it creates the fire one. Okay, you come out here. Oh, he's lying. Come here, come here. Okay. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> he shoved it down my throat. Very good. It's a little bit spicy though. But I can't believe. I thought it was gonna burn my mouth. Thank you. A little bit spicy, but I actually really enjoy pushka. It tastes really good. Wow, that was crazy. <laughs> My fushka is very crazy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, mate, it's a little bit spicy. I always find that fushka is a bit spicy for me. Ooh. Okay, boss, one more today. Thank you. No, no, I pay. No, no, no. No, no, I pay. No, 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 no. Thank you. No, 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 no. Thank you. Bye, bye, bye. No more today. No, 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 no. No more today. I want again, again, again. For you, for you. Nah. Tip, tip, tip. Nah. Tip, tip. No Many, more I, today. I really want to give this. No more today. Please. Gift, gift. Gift, gift. No, no, you. Give, give no. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. No, no. Yes, yes. Okay, thank bye. you. Very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Donovan. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, bye. I love you all. Bangladesh on here. Alright, I'll come back. <laughs> bye. Thank you. Australia. Yeah, yeah, Australia. Australia, Sydney, capital. Sydney, Sydney. Yeah, Sydney. Oh, yeah, Modina, Sydney. Modina, Lalba. Lalba, Lalba, Modina. Modina. He really went hard on it. It wasn't like a little bit. Was... <laughs> he shoved it right. He made sure that I didn't get burnt in there. Huh? Okay, thank, you Bye. thank you very much. Have a good day. <laughs> bye bye. All right. <laughs> Look at these chickens, everybody. They've been freshly pocked. They go from that, and then in a couple minutes, they end up like that, hanging on the uh, on the rack. Salam alaikum. I would shake your hand, but I don't want chicken guts all over me. Look, he's even got like a, the chicken head, the chicken feet. Oh my goodness, it smells uh, pretty horrific here. But these are... It's unfortunate, buddy, but you're going to be a chicken nugget soon. It is, uh, it is unfortunate. But I think we're waiting on our next moves. But I just wanted to quickly show you. It's a little bit early, but this is Bismillah Kebab. This is the really famous one. Me and Nadir were trying to get here, but... You know, like especially on a Friday, it has such varying opening times. But just a super local spot. There's all the kebab meat that the man's cooking up. So maybe it'll open shortly. But yeah, this is one of the most famous uh, eateries here in Old Dhaka. But let's go figure out what we're doing next. All right, guys, we're on another rickshaw going to our next destination. It's so helpful having Bengali friends because we have no idea what is going on and it's... Should be abducting us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally. I think he knows where we're going now, but it just reduces like the brain power that we have to use uh, like with them communicating in the local languages, so it's a lot easier. So shout out to them for coming along on the journey with us. I think they're behind us in their own... Or maybe not. I think they're coming though. But we all should be meeting at the same meeting point. But this, is this electric? I think it's electric. Yeah, he's, he's not even pedaling, but we're going fast. Oh, uh, Tesla rickshaw. Yeah, Elon Musk, where you are? Oh, actually, I remember walking down here with Nadir. I think we were trying Fukcha to the uh, just to the left up here. Yeah, because I remember seeing all the meat markets. And then when we were leaving, we were going down this road, but I'm pretty sure if my geography and navigation skills are correct, the left should be a park. And yes, it is. That's where we had Fuchka the last time. But the fire one, that was an experience and a half. That was good. Hey, those guys are back, four people on a bike, crazy.
Pizza, pizza. Pizza man, hello. Pizza. <laughs> Alright, we've been uh, on this for what 10 15 minutes just going through. Oh, I think we're going to this fort. Oh, yeah, Lalabag Fort. Have you been? No, but I've heard of it. Yeah, actually, you know, they were talking about that when we were figuring out our next destination. We have no idea where the other guys are. They probably got caught behind traffic kilometers back. But uh, this area is absolutely popping off. Oh, oh. <laughs> all right. So I think we're getting off here to the sweet shop. I'll, I'll grab this one. Alright, right, I don't think they're anywhere to be seen. Who are you? Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum salam. Tom and Amki? You want to shake again? Very good. Thank you. Uh, okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't about it. Alright. So, uh, we'll wait for the others and then we'll go inside and try some sweets. Alright, so here we have some sweets, everybody. We're going to try out a couple. Looks like they got samosa, jalabi. Oh, look at all of them here. Salam alaikum. Wow. All these different kinds of Bengali sweets. Oh, is that? Oh, I think that's gulab jamun. I've had that in India and Pakistan. Oh, look. So you literally just like sit at these kind of these steel seats. Look at all of them. All kinds of things. Wow. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All right, let's take a seat. Ooh. Look at this. It's like super, it's just like like metal. Like silverware. Got all the tables and stuff here that we'll try out. So I think we're gonna let the guys order and I'll just bring out some sweets. Some of the best ones here in Bangladesh. What is, what is the most, like what is famous? Uh -huh. For you and for you, for you, for me, for all of us. Okay, yeah, we just. Have, they have coffee or milk tea. Oh yeah, do they have cha? I think I think I saw that. Yeah, yeah. Lady having some. Water. Yeah. It's pretty chaotic in here. It's busy. All these people just eating their meals. But it's gonna be nice. Biting into some dessert in the evening time. All right, here is our first one. Wow. Looks like kind of like custard. What is this one called? Jafran. 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 Jafran sweet. Jafran sweet. All right. Thank you. Alright, so we got a couple more here. All the, this is. So, what's this one? Kashmiri halwa. Kashmiri halwa. 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 This is badami sandwich. Oh. Wow, and they're all they're all sweets, right? Yeah, all sweets. And then this one? Wow. Badam short. Peanut from Okay. So how much does each one cost roughly? Uh, so the total is 70 taka. 70? 60? 60? 100? 100? And then the price is 65. Okay. So like less than a dollar for each one. Yeah. Alright, let's try this one. Everyone has one of these. I want to try like the uh the watery bit first. Mike? No. Oh. Yeah, it's like buttery, like milky butter. Okay, let's get all this. Made from milk. They're all from milk? I'm sure it's good. Wow, alright. You can see in the middle, it's kind of like 
that soft. I feel like I've had something like this. Maybe it was at uh, uh, the Sky Dining in uh, Cox's Bazaar. Let's try this out. Got a big mouthful. Mm. Wow. It's so sweet. It's so soft. It's kind of like, like buttermilk. Just infused in it all. Wow, look at that in the middle. It's kind of got the yellowy edge. But then in the middle it's just like all white. Let's try a, another bit. Mm. That one's really sweet. I like that. I liked it. It was good. Kashmiri halwa. Kashmiri halwa. And what is it, what is it made out of? It's also made from uh, milk and some fruits. Okay. Maybe. All right. Let's get. Oh, it's kind of like pudding. Oh, you want yeah the jelly bit? Yeah. Oh, there we go. All right. Wow. That has like a very um similar taste. Not as uh, strong, but it has like a still like. I like it. It's not it's not as sweet, but it's nice. It kind of like has a more like less sweet taste to it. Still very sweet. But you get like the jelly bits as well. I like that one, that one's good. I think that one's my favorite so far. This one's just so sweet. It's like got so much sweetness in there. Out of out of all of these, which one is your favorite? Like you you've had these before. Yeah. Which one do you like the best? I like this one. Yeah. All right, let's try this one. So there's like almonds on top. It kind of all comes like with a similar like taste. I feel they have like a very similar taste. It's just like the level of potency. But let's uh, cut that. Oh, look at that. Peanut and milk. Peanut and milk. Look at that. It's like soft in the middle. Well, let's try this. Again, a very similar taste. Like very milky, but like kind of sweet milk. Peanut short malai. Peanut. Peanut short malai. Peanut short. Short. Ah, oh, short. Short means a milk. Milk. Just not milk. Ah, oh, right. Alright, so we tried that. We tried that. We tried that one. This is Bean Bok and it's 40 taka. 40 taka. Bean Bok. They have milk in here, chai. Like it has egg. Yeah. Egg. In there. Egg in there. Do they have milk to ear, oh, I think that was the one that I had at child. Fly Dining. It looks very similar. It had that like powdery bit on the top. That one looks good. But this also looks very similar. Let's try it. Look at this. It's got like that crusty bit in there. Wow, look. It's so moist in the middle. That is so sweet. Wow. Honestly, I think that one's my favorite. But like after trying all of these, it's just so sweet. Like I'm already full. I couldn't eat, I could not eat anymore. You just, like, it's so, so much amount of sugar. It's crazy. But this is yummy. This one is very good. Which one is the best? I like this one. This one is the best. What's the name of this one? Uh, this one. I forgot. Look. 
in here but finished up eating the sweets here in Dhaka they were really good glad I tried them out hey little goats how are you are you doing good you good little goat you're a good little goaty <laughs> all right I think we're organizing a, uh, a rickshaw or a uber out of old Dhaka I don't actually know if we're still in old Dhaka is this still considered the old part of town? I don't think so. These apartment buildings look really new. But we'll see what happens. <laughs> Alright guys, it's the next morning and I realized I didn't do an outro uh, for this video, but it was a fun day in, uh, in Old Dhaka. I really didn't know what was going to happen. It was kind of just like meet up with a bunch of friends, explore the area, but it turned out to be a really fun video, really fun vlog. And I really enjoyed the time there. We got to try the fire pond, we got to try the fire fuchka. So those were two amazing experiences um, that I really wanted to try here. I didn't even know fire fuchka was a thing, but it was a damn cool experience. But thank you so much for watching the video, everybody. As always, chase your dreams. And we'll see you all on the next one. Goodbye.